Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about how to insert an image into Autodesk Inventor, scale it up, and prepare it so that it's ready for you guys to use as a reference and model that same image. Right, so first things first, start off your sketch. Right under the Insert tab, you're going to see an option that says Image. Let's go ahead and select that, bring in our image, and place it in a location. Right, so then that brings our image. In my case, I want to go ahead and rotate that image. So let's go ahead and rotate it. Select that image, select a center point. For me, it's going to be that origin once again. And give it a specific rotation. From here, you can move it closer to the origin if you like. For me, that's going to be fine. Now you want to go ahead and check to see if it's scaled properly, right? So one way you can check is by just create a line. Zoom in here a little bit, try to be as exact as possible, right? So we want the distance from the top of that blade to the bottom to be five and a half inches. In this case, you can tell that it's somewhere around 7.9, right? So let's go ahead and change that. Let's create that line first. Next, what you want to do is go into scale. We want to go ahead and select that image to scale. Our base point is going to be that same origin. All right, so now it's asking you for the scale factor here. You can go ahead and expand that measure. What do we want to measure? We want to measure the entire length of that blade right now. Notice that it gives you 7.897 inches, right? So let's think about this for a little bit. We want to scale down, so that means that our scale factor has to be less than one, right? So what you can do is input your final dimension, divide that by the current dimension, and that'll give you a value that is less than one. Once you hit apply, you can see that it scaled down, which is good. Now let's go ahead and double check that it did scale to 5.5. So once again, creating that line, you can select the top of that blade, zoom in a little bit here. And you can see that it is indeed 5.5 inches. So that's been how to bring in an image into Autodesk Inventor and scale it. Hope that helped.